Crop pollination by honeybees and other insects plays an essential role in the production of most fruits, vegetables, and nuts. But some pollinators are suffering long-term population declines that could disrupt their beneficial impact on agriculture and threaten food security. Increasing exposure to insecticides used in crop protection is a concern. How do we effectively balance the use of pesticides to control agricultural pests without unintentionally poisoning pollinators? To minimize the harm pesticides can have on pollinators, entomologists at Purdue University are documenting how honeybees are exposed to agrochemicals in the environment. This work is funded through the USDA Specialty Crop Research Initiative. The researchers focus largely on neonicotinoid insecticides, a relatively new class of chemicals that are broadly toxic to insects and documented two exposure routes. First, when farmers apply neonicotinoids to crops that rely on pollinators, such as watermelons, the plants absorb the insecticide, which then spread throughout the plant, including in pollen and nectar, which bees use as food. These insecticides also move in groundwater to weeds surrounding crop fields. The second route of exposure involves applying neonicotinoids as a coating to corn and soybean seeds. During planting, these seeds lose some of that pesticide seed coating, which forms a dust blown into the air. This dust can contact foraging bees in mid-air or when they land on contaminated wildflowers. Neonicotinoid insecticides are toxic to bees at extremely low doses, so one solution is to reduce their use to the minimum possible level that controls pests, or not using them at all if no pests are present. This approach is known as Integrated Pest Management, or IPM, a strategy that involves scouting for pests and only applying insecticides as a last resort when they threaten to destroy the crop. We can improve pollinator health by avoiding overuse of these increasingly common insecticides. While there are other factors that are harming bee populations, neonicotinoid insecticides are a pervasive stress that can make bees more susceptible to other stressors, like varroa mites and diseases. The research conducted by Purdue entomologists is a key component of a more holistic strategy that seeks to create a healthier environment for pollinators without compromising food production.